What is up? I'm Water Turtle, and today we have we have our first box of Temporal Forces, uh, the new set that is as of filming uh, is set to be released this Friday. And uh, yeah, we we're able, fortunately enough, to get this a little bit early, and so we will crack our first box. Uh, this will be just for myself. We may have some breaks in the near future, and. Um, yeah, I feel like I said in the Discord, like, I feel like my excitement level is, I put it at a 7 out of 10. Uh, because, like, the new, the the dogs, I don't know, sometimes I think they're cats, like the Suicune, Raikou. Uh, I guess we have these some other legendaries as well uh, for both, like, the future and the, whatever, the, the past versions. Um, it feels kind of like Chilling Rain when they kind of had, like, the new versions of the legendaries uh, for a set. Actually, just gonna move display a little bit over here and here we go into our first pack uh not sure what we're supposed to do here let's do four like that and see what we got i'm just gonna make this a little bit bigger all right a mud sail into drillbur into a latias into whimsicott I will say that I'm guessing the next couple sets, it's kind of like you're always in the shadow when you're in the shadow of a great set. Like 151 was a while ago, but um, then Paldean Fates was, it was pretty good. Uh, but I feel like just on the on the heels of multiple special sets, it's tough for any regular set to really pop off. Got a Miss Energy, a Breloom. And there are some cool stuff. Like we do have the whole Ace Spec thing coming back. See if we get any of those. Uh, yeah, so things that I'm looking for. I think the the Altar Drampa looked really nice. It reminded me of um, I'm not sure which Dragon Ball series it was, but I feel like I was maybe it's GT, like Goku, and I feel like it's a little Goku. So maybe it was GT when he somehow got like reborn or whatever. Um, riding was the what's the dragon's name? Shenron, and that's what the Drampa like it. I feel like that definitely got like inspiration from that. So I would love to pull that. And then the uh, the Raikou, whatever the, the special form of Raikou is, it it's definitely looks like the um, Horizon Zero Dawn, uh, the, big, uh, the big giraffe robot. All right, we got a Koraiden. Um, yeah, you know, they're still pushing these, uh, these uh, new guys, the, the bike guys. All right, so we do got our first EX, and it is a Torterra. We got a turtle Pokemon. It is just a regular EX, though, so nothing too crazy. Is this an ace pack? Nope. Future Capsule. And as always, we'll keep an eye out to see what the pull ratio is. Uh, with new sets, I'm hoping for double digits with, like, one, hopefully two big hits. I feel like that's kind of, for me, the new bar for success. Got a Hunter into a Iron Valiant. Okay. Just gonna adjust my piles a little bit. No, it's been a little bit since we've dropped any videos. Uh, there's actually a lot going on in my personal life. So hopefully a lot of the stuff that's been keeping me really busy will die down probably like in the next couple of months or so. Airy. Oh, yeah, I think I feel like I remember what were these people called they eventually you fight like a big vehicle man. That was weird Then eventually I think it's like penny that's like in charge of them all or something All right, so we do got one hit nothing to write home about Let's get something better a grubbin into a Bolton into a for alligator. Oh, okay I feel like a lot of times for alligator, it's one of those Pokemon, there's only so much you can do because like, oh, I feel like this art kind of looks familiar, but maybe after after like the first 20, 20 arts of a certain Pokemon, they start to look alike. Same thing with that Torterra, actually. <laughs> yeah, so let me know how, how people are feeling about this set. Yeah, put myself at 7 out of 10, although Chilling Rain... I feel like it's one where, I don't know, when I feel like when it came out, no one was excited about it. But I feel like the the prices of it, the boxes have been going up. Uh, I'm not sure if that's just like the timing wise. That was like post craziness. And then, you know, 
people thought like the stuff was dying down. A great tusk. Okay, so this is the ancient form. Ooh, all right, we got our first, first alt art, a Reuniclus. This was always one of the otter Pokemon. It's kind of like in that bubble thing. I mean, it's kind of cute, but uh, I feel like the, the bar for alt art is just so high these days. Uh, we haven't gone through all like the commons and uncommons. We'll kind of just scroll through, see if there's anything interesting. Iron hands for the future. I guess all the future cards have iron something. Or like the ancients, I feel like are more uniquely named. A Delcaddy into an Exadrill. Oh, oh man, close. I want the. I should have been more specific. All right, we got Raging Bolt, the ancient form of Raikou. Yeah, they got much better names. Look at that thing. All right, let's pull. Let's be very specific. Let's pull the alt art version of this card because um. Yeah, not that that really probably impacted it, but uh, yeah, so let's get the alt art version <laughs> of Raging Bolt. Actually, I want to take a look at the centering real quick, too, of this initial wave. Here's the Maridon. This is the, the form of the game that I played. And then a Whimsicott. Let's just take a look at this, this ability. Uh, wafting heal when you play this Pokemon from your hand evolve from Pokemon. Sorry, so when you evolve it, you may heal all damage from one active grass Pokemon. Ooh, discard all energy though. Hmm. Rescue board. Three costs attached to is less. HP is 30 less. Okay. We got an ancient form of Magneton. Sandy Shock. It's a fighting type. That's interesting. Then some kind of hair clipper. The items I feel like in this game are always like, uh, is what? All right, we got a bird into a scary spider. Oh boy, guys, we are pulling the alt art raging bolt. <laughs> this is a raging bolt kind of box. Let's take a look at center real quick, although not that we would grade this, but looks pretty good. We got a dot in the corner. All right, that is four hits in the bank no home runs yet one alt art almost halfway through a box Ooh, a little aggressive on that pack all right graph rig into a frost moth into iron Ooh, i do like that one it's like a robot robot dinosaur Eh, nothing too crazy. But let's see, what else is going on in the Pokemon TCG? Uh, yeah, so I feel like one thing I've been closely monitoring is the prices of the Van Gogh Pikachu, especially in the in Europe. Um, and I do have someone that... I do know someone lives in Europe, so I was able to purchase some on card market and have them sent there i uh, never used card market before so i didn't realize that the price like obviously the price was cheaper there because that's where they had the event um but like card market you pay like a, a premium price for like everything you buy or actually it's when you like uh stock your account with credit like you can't pay with credit card or you can you have to credit your account on card market and then you buy it with your credit and then because i don't have a eu based bank account like there was like a fee which is a little annoying a caldeo into a mel metal there was a pokemon on the screen these from the future it probably would have been mel metal right i feel like whenever i see this it's like wait is there something in the commons so just the ancients all right about halfway through the box we'll probably start trying to speed things up try to get to those hit all right we do got a Wait, oh, I thought this was a spec. <laughs> no, no, it's just a future uh, trainer. Then a fish. All right, last pack of the first half. Four hits on a half. Hopefully get one more to make it five to put us on track for that double digit count. Pins into Salvatore. All right, there is, okay. I like the fact that this is a dog 
a dog box leaning toward raging bolts things are looking up i don't remember like between entei and suicune uh which one i liked better but definitely raging bolts was number one for me i uh, just that in case you don't know what i'm talking i don't know what the thing is called in horizon zero dawn i wonder if you just type in like something like really tall robot looks like a giraffe of some sort all right we got another exa gengar all right we're really uh starting to pile up the you know the 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 hits that are like yes they're hits but not the uh not the quality we're looking for all right and um while it's kind of like when you get like your big hit right away it's like mm, okay maybe there's nothing left in this box but now we're starting to get to the point of, all right, where's the heat in this box? Not super nervous yet, but it's starting to accumulate. Electivire. Hey, anchor into the Mel Metal again. But yeah, we have all, all these, um, I don't know what those legendary is, like, but the Verizian, the Cabalion. All the, the four-legged <laughs> legendaries in this set that I feel like there never was a whole lot of uh, a great level of appreciation. We got another ancient flutter main. And that's what the Suikun looks like. It's kind of weird to be honest. It's a little alien to me. All right, we got a another alt art, a bronzor. Ah, oh, I I categorize this as like, and I feel like there's a lot of them where it's cute, but nothing amazing. So we will take alt arts over the EXs all day, even alt arts over full arts for me actually. Like the raging bolt, uh, I think the thing that most excites was like, oh, we're getting close to what I really want. Uh, but I'll take the alt arts over that. Even if it's like, you know, not the not the chase ones like the Bonzor or this Reuniclus. Hey, another Coridon. Okay, now we are officially nervous. Where is our hits? Please don't please don't give me just like a I don't know, like rainbow or gold trainer or something like that all right a maridan ex okay so they have exes of them as well boxed order <laughs> okay scream tail this is like a jigglypuff then a Dunsparce. All right, I feel like, what are we at? Like eight? Oh, come on. Come on, we could do better than this. Melton into Iron Thorns. All right, long way to go. We're gonna need to clutch up very soon. Rescue board. Be be human and then raging moon i like that name raging moon salamance was never my favorite it's also interesting that the ancients they don't have like evolution ponyta to medicham okay always happy to pull supporters um although i preferred them to be named characters but we'll take it look at the top six cards of your deck put two of them into your hand discard the others interesting that actually does not sound bad now i don't remember like all like the max rarities in the set i think they had to have like that new form of gold again which i like it but i would definitely vastly prefer the alt arts and i think that's like just as far as chase goes, that's max max rarity in every aspect. Oh, I like that turtle. It's cute. Okay, we got another cute one. Chinchino, alt art. 
I like it how, oh, I love that Tarantar plush. What was it? I think there was a Meowth card that had like a Pokedoll like plush that looked very similar. Uh, but we got the um, whatever before Delcaddy is and then a Meryl as well. Okay, I think this one is better than the previous alt arts. Leveling up and oh boy, only four packs left. No home run hit. Not even like a, well, not secret rare. Everything is secret rare these days, but like a max rarity hit. Ugh, I earned Boulder. Okay, okay. Hit count is probably getting up there close to double digits, but we need the heat. Like, no way a full art is your, like, best hit, right? That's that's ridiculous. To some tumbleweed. Two packs remaining. All right. I'm very nervous. We got a Master Ball. Is this one the Ace Spec? Okay, maybe maybe the other one was Ace Spec. Maybe I just didn't know where to look. But this one definitely is a Spec. We got a Master Ball. Search your deck for a Pokemon. Reveal it. Put it into your hand. No questions asked. No flipping. No discard. Straight up Master Ball. I wonder if that's a good hit. I have no idea. Into a Mel Metal. Oh, boy. All right. Oh, stretch a little bit. Get ready for this last pack. We have a lot riding on this Verizian Robot. It reminds me of, what is it, like Boston Dynamics or something that has those like robots that like walk around like very, like very uh, organically for lack of a better word. Although it has no head. Come on. Oh boy, I'm scared. Oh, that's cruel. It's, I didn't realize that the, um, I'm assuming this is just like the regular art and then it's just the alt art of this exact card. Like it actually looks very similar, although there's just like people on it. <laughs> oh, that's cruel, Pokemon. All right. I feel like we didn't do great, but we'll do a count. I'm going to include the Master Ball in there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. All right. Plenty on the hit count. It's the, uh, yeah, the hit value. We got alt art. Let's pull you forward. Full art trainer. Another alt art. All right. This one is a full art. Oh, man. All right. So what I would consider, like, actually, like, pretty good hits. It's like five. I don't know where to include this master ball. Uh, but, yeah, really lacking that, that big hit in this box. So a little disappointing. Uh, I feel like I might have to go for another one, but we'll see. As always, guys, thanks for watching. And um, yeah, stay uh, like, comment, subscribe. As always, I'm Water Turtle. I'll catch you all next time. Peace.